This is one of the hardest SAT math problem. But if you know the trick, this is one of the easiest problem. Our equation is given to us and we have to find what is three to the power n plus two. In the equation, three to the power n plus three, so we have to convert three to the power n plus three to three to the power n plus two. So three to the power n plus three can be written as three times three to the power n plus two. How we have done this? Let me show you. So three can be written as three to the power one times three to the power n plus two. So we can use the exponent law of multiplication. So when the power are having same basis, then we can add the powers. So it can be written as one plus n plus two. So both the powers will get added. So it is three to the power n plus three. So from this, we can say that three to the power n plus three is equal to three times three to the power n plus two. So let's write the equation now. So three plus three to the power n plus three is written as three times three to the power n plus two is equal to 81. So we can take three common outside. So one plus three to the power n plus two is equal to 81. So we'll divide both the sides by three. So one plus three to the power n plus two is equal to 81 divided by three is 27. Now we'll take one on the other side. So three to the power n plus two is equal to 27 minus one, that is 26. So we have to find what was three to the power n plus two. So option C, 26 is your correct answer.